Well, first of all, I would like to thank you for your very heartfelt video. Uh, and I think, to a large extent, you fit the nail right on the head. I think that a lot of people have very short attention spans and they're very vulnerable to this rabble-rousing from the media to take these petty things and to blow them way out of proportion. Uh, it's very unfortunate that they lose sight of priorities. Their lives just turn into chaos, going from one sensation to the other. <laughs> it's, and just losing track, not being able to keep track of where their lives are headed. Um, it's very unfortunate, you know, a lot of the freedom that they're clamoring about is, is the freedom to act out like petulant two-year-olds. It's very unfortunate. It's, it's such a tragic loss, <laughs> you know, but uh, I guess, you know, life can be a tragedy to, the, to those who feel. Life can be a comedy to those who think, you know. I. I'm sort of torn sometimes, you know, I, I felt very sad about your videos and I, and I could tell that this really upsets you. Um, and it upsets a lot of people, it's very upsetting when you think about it and you think, holy shit, <laughs> you know, there's, there's a lot of waste, a lot of wasted time, you know, that people are spending with these petty squabbles and not really addressing the real issues, not really focusing on the important things in their lives. Um, and it is a horrible waste. Um, you know, the same token, I, I think that it's necessary to develop a sense of humor about the whole thing. Um, because it's the kind of thing that can be very depressing, okay? So I hope that I hope that you'll keep with your videos because I think you've got a very important message, and and I really appreciate them. Uh, and I hope that you learn how to be happy, um, that it's possible even in these times, even amongst all this chaos and these people who are short-sighted and explosive over trivial things, I hope you will find how to be happy with your life and how to show others to be happy with theirs. So, uh, and it's possible. There are people who have suffered tragic losses and who learn to be happy. Happiness comes from inside. When you're happy inside, that gives you the strength to go about changing the world. And that's what we all want, isn't it? So, anyways, thanks for your video. I just, I just wanted to, wanted to comment. So, thanks. Bye.